Hey you guys, we have a shopping haul today. I got this mystery Squishmallow, which I got two more and we're gonna open them on camera because I'm debating on the ones I'm gonna keep and give to my friends. So we're gonna open it. I'm excited, they're so much fun. I opened it off camera and I'm like, let's do it on camera. I'm hoping it's either this one right here with the candy cane or this one with the earmuffs. So I'll see, I don't know. If you guys wanna try to see it before me? No, I'm gonna see it before, it's okay. No. Oh, but this is so cute. Not what I was hoping, but this is adorable. I actually love on the low that they are a mystery. So I got this one right here, cute. I love that they're mystery because it's like you're really going off like a personality instead of like the look of something. So I like the whole aspect of like getting a mystery one. You have like a greater appreciation for it. Cause I think that goes to show like with dating too. I think it's really about someone's heart and personality. Like the looks like it's whatever. Like yeah, I still gotta be attracted to someone, but it's like, I wanna care about someone's heart and personality more. That's what I love about like the mysteries instead of like just buying a random one because they're cute for the holidays and you never know which one you're gonna get. Like you have to buy it and take a risk, you know? Okay, let's do the other, I'm excited. What if I got two the same? I'm a little worried, not gonna lie. I love the packaging. Same as the one before in my oh i have another duplicate no way oh cute oh, these are hard to open not gonna lie y'all oh i have another one yay yay this is actually fun opening this one on camera i'm actually kind of happy i got the same one because this is the one i opened off camera and i'm like oh this is so cute but we have twins we literally have twins which is actually perfect because this is what i was going to end up doing i am giving one of these to one of my friends because it completes the bag because I'm getting her like a cute blanket. So you can't go wrong with like a Squishmallow. And since I have two of the same, I can keep these two and give my friend this one. So it's perfect. Hey y'all, I just wanted to pop on the video because I realized for quite some time now, I've never actually shown you guys like a proper haul of cereal candles I got at Target. So I'm just going to include it in this haul because I did do some more holiday shopping and I did just upload my other Target video that I just filmed recently. I've been like on a roll with like Target videos this year and shopping for the holidays now, but these candles definitely deserve a mention. So we have Cinnamon Toast Crunch. We have Lucky Charms. This one is so aesthetically so cute, you guys. Oh my goodness. And then we got Lucky Charms right there, Cocoa Puffs, and that's pretty much it. And let's get into the rest of the haul now. Hey guys, I swear I'm back. I'll have to explain what happened. My hat's still on. I literally had to like run out. So I had an online order and so I had enough time to film the Squishmallow part, but not the rest of the haul. So now we're going to do that. <laughs> I ate some food. I was able to recharge a little bit. Now we're back to the haul. This blanket is actually going to be for my one friend i won't like say who just in case my friends watch videos so i'm not worried like showing it but with the stuffed animal she's gonna get this blanket i love like how that stuffed animal's red and this is green it's perfect for christmas so next we're gonna grab i got a Candyland game this game is one of my nostalgic childhood games honestly did you ever get like a box that like had chocolate pieces and like you ate them as you played i hope this one has it that's why i bought it <laughs> because i want to play it this year like for old time's sake so yeah i will show you the next thing i got i know i know you're thinking holiday barbie if you guys have been keeping up on my channel since summer literally i decided to change up my childhood bedroom this is my bathroom it's actually part of it as well the official tour is coming out very soon by the latest december but i'm hoping honestly in november i can get it uploaded because i've been like shopping a lot and getting this room together as well for holidays cleaning out things getting the room ready you guys have seen some little sneak peeks but you guys haven't seen anything yet i'm excited it's like really almost done but i'm actually going to be decorating the childhood bedroom for christmas this year i wanted to decorate the childhood bedroom during the fall season but i didn't because i didn't have the room quite done yet and so anyways the holiday barbie doll is literally my nostalgia i love how they have different barbies i got this one because she looks the most like me i love how every barbie has a representation of every culture she pretty she gorgeous I'm going to set it out for decor. Basically, you don't open these. They literally stay in the box and you treasure them for years. I literally have two others that I'll include in the room tour. One's like a pink one, one's a blue one. I've literally never opened them. Like that's just like what they are. I think the box like got old over time, but like the Barbies are still in perfect condition. Like that's the whole point. It's so funny because I played with Barbies like growing up, but never those two because they were display Barbies. So yeah, you don't play with them exactly. I mean, I'm an adult now, but back then, like I didn't play with them. I never touched them. I'm excited for you guys to see those but then decorating after I film the room tour. You guys will see this one. And it's so cute. And she looks like me this time. So it's even more special. Next, I've been getting tissue paper like crazy. I already bought one. And then I have another now. It's the same thing as red. So I won't like show that. I got a couple winter outfits. I'll show one first. I don't know. With the holidays, I love wearing like, you know, sweaters. Not gonna lie. If they don't fit me, I'm going to return them. But they are so cute. And 
We will see if I wear them in future videos or not. But I haven't got one of these in a hot minute since like 2019. I mean, honestly, that one was cute on me, but that was an era itself of my life. <laughs> that I constantly don't always want to remember. Um, so I got a gingerbread one. I think it's so cute. I actually think it's cuter than the one I had a few years ago, honestly. I mean, that one was kind of cute too, not gonna lie. So from Starbucks, I got a couple more snowman cookies because they're so good, you guys. I like love them so much. And then I went to World Market. They gave me ginger snaps, which I love ginger snaps. So I'm excited. That was sweet. It was like for free at World Market. What a steal. And then the last things are Petco. It's been a while since I went to Petco. Look at this bag. It is so cute, you guys. I'm absolutely in love with the bag. I decided to get new collars for Peanut and Jackson. If you guys don't know, I have a dog. She's a black lab named Peanut and she's everything. She's the only peanut I can have because I am allergic to the actual food of peanut butter, not my dog's peanut butter. And then Jackson is my boy, my sweet boy, and he's my world too. But anyways, I have like a donut color for Peanut and then I have this rose color for Jackson. I tried to find like a pink one for Peanut and a blue one for Jax, like boy girl theme. This one's very girly and I think this one's somewhat masculine but i think the roses are really cute and i just love donuts i don't know i just like want them to have some cute new colors and that's gonna be all for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel my name is melanie and i'll see you guys next time bye